In the land management setting, there's a wide range of different CAD attachments that we offer to add versatility to your machines. Whether that be a compact wheel loader, a compact track loader, multi-terrain loader, or skid steer loader, we offer a range of stump grinders in addition to brush cutters, mulchers, industrial grapple rakes, all in an effort to get those jobs done faster, clearing land for a commercial or residential property, or just general maintenance of a property, all can be done with the use of these attachments. Specifically, we're gonna talk about the stump grinders today, SG16B and SG18B. The two differences between the models are one, hydraulic platform, and also depth control, which we'll get into in a second. In terms of hydraulic platform, the SG16B is our standard flow unit. That's compatible with a wide range of machines, and in order to step up into the SG18B, which I have behind me, you will need a high flow XPS or high flow capable machine. The key differences between the two units are the way they control the depth of the cutter wheel. A stump grinder uses a 32 pronged cutter wheel out front with hardened reinforced carbide bits that shred material, whether that be a hardwood or a softwood or pine like we have here in North Carolina. On the stump grinder itself, you've got key features that allow the machine to sit on a stable surface and then control the grinding of the wheel independently. Utilizing these pivot feet on the bottom of the tool, you have two different depth settings which allow you to get those pivot feet down onto an uneven surface, whether it be undulating on the left and right side or the surfaces below the machine tracks, you can still provide a stable surface with these feet. What these allow you to do is to pinpoint the machine on the ground and allow the extension rods that you'll see on the front of the stump grinder to work the cutter wheel forward and back. In the operation of this, you'll also rotate the cutter wheel side to side or swing left to right. It's very easy to do that utilizing the in-cab joystick controls on this D-Series compact track loader. You can also see on the front of this SG18B, you have independent control of the depth. On the SG16B, you'll control this manually, but on this model, we can not only control the extension, we can control the swing, and also the depth of that wheel. So all three rotations or all three directions in which you need to grind that stump, you can control from the cab of the machine without having to get out or without having to move the machine. It's very key in order to make sure that you can grind that stump very efficiently and safely. The CAT Stump Grinder family features a direct drive hydraulic motor. Whether that be standard flow or high flow, this translates the energy from the machine in terms of oil into just grinding torque. This grinding torque uses 32 carbide bits that are easily bolt on for replacement and make sure that you can get through the hardest of material all the way down to softwoods and make sure you can grind them below ground level to easily maintain afterward with a garden tractor or a lawnmower. As we work to the back of the tool, you'll see something that we feature on all CAD attachments and that is a bolt on serrated step. This serrated step allows me to get into and out of that cab very easily, utilizing three points of contact, ensuring that the life of this tool, or throughout the life of this tool, I can then operate it safely. You'll also see CAT XT3 hoses, which ensure leak tree performance over the life of that tool, again, extending the duration of the life of this tool and the tip to tail combination. For more information on the CAT stump grinder portfolio or the wide range of attachments that we offer in the land management setting, I encourage you to contact your local CAT dealer, check us out at cat.com, and I'll see you next time.